Well, this is a new for me. I have never done this before. Hello, everyone. I um, am doing a recorded video. Actually, that's not true. I did a tutorial once a long time ago. Um, I went to the thrift store today and I thought I would do a video and show you all what I got. So I got this holiday fun quiz. I'm just going to jump right in. I'm not going to talk your ear off or anything like that. I'm just going to jump right in. So this holiday fun quiz pack. And then it has all these different cards in these cool colors. And it says, which of Santa Claus's reindeer shares its name with a type of animal? And the answer is Vixen, a female fox. I've got questions like that. I'm going to split these into packs, all the different colors. So that's one thing I got. And I got these Fisher Price letters. And let me see, this is taped shut. I do not want to rip the box. Let me grab a knife. Luckily, I'm in the dining room so I can grab it. Knife quickly. Go. Get rushed out of the drain board. Okay. These are the bigger letters. Those. There's the box. These are from 1986. So I said those were pretty cool, and I love the box. Now you gotta bear with me while I put them all back in the box. <laughs> no editing. No editing, piece. That's ah, not that pink. It only takes a second. Right? Right. So I hope everyone's been doing well been enjoying the summer. Today's September 1st. Summer's all done. Although today it was in the 60s and today it was, yeah, 60 today. And tonight or tomorrow it's supposed to get back in the 80s. So this is a no. Did I just see a chipmunk or did I see a beaver? What did I see? There's a bear. Oh, how cute. <laughs> There's the chipmunk. There he is. I love chipmunks. They're so cute. I love these old readers. New streets and roads. Very cute. I guess I can put that over here for now. I don't need that. Um, I found a tiny, well, a small. Could be tiny, depending on how big you are. <laughs> Ralph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Um, look. Pretty cool. I don't know what year it's from. Oh, it's from Smuckers. It was a giveaway. Smuckers. The name like Smuckers it has to be good. 1976. And then I picked up some little golden books. I got jingle bells. I didn't even check out the condition. I just grabbed them. There's a UPC on that one. But I love this story. I love this story because of the snowflakes on the pictures. I think it's, they're cool. Look how cute. I got that one. I got the little red hen. The traditional illustrations. 1980. Love it, love it, love it. That one. I got Frosty. No UPC on that one. This one's going to be kind of old. Let's see. 1980. I love the illustrations in this one too. 
super cute. Very, uh, they remind me of the illustrations in this, in this reader. And the store-bought doll. So cute. This one's probably from the same person. No, yep. Mary Foster. This is from this this kid's little sister. <laughs> Jonathan and Mary Foster. Let's see. Um, 1983. Very cute. Very little house on the prairie-esque. Christina and Lucy. Cutesy, cute, cute. I love little golden books. And then I got this children's guide to knowledge. Every time I see this book, I buy it. Every time. Well, depending on how much it is, but it's got the most amazing illustrations in it. It's got black and white, and then it has the most beautiful color. Look at the beautiful color illustrations in that. I just love it. Just love it. There's some really gorgeous ones in here. Look at the owl. Move these out of the way and then I can get in camera a little bit better. One second. I know people are going to fast forward through most of this and that's okay because I do it too. Great blue hair and I saw one of these in flight the other day. I don't see that very often. Well, I don't anyway. I love this book. It's beautiful. There are some. <laughs> what is she doing there? Ask someone. In there, it's five years old. What, what is that lady doing? <laughs> I wonder if they would know. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if they would. Anyway, I love that book. And I bought a purse, a bag, whatever you want to call it. I might keep it. I might sell it. I don't know. I picked it up because I like it. Um, I might switch all my stuff over to it. I don't know. It's L. I, I don't know if that's anything good, but I don't think it was ever, ever, ever used. And I love the colors. I like that it has a light interior so I can actually see inside the darn thing. Yeah. I mean, you can tell the handle doesn't have like any wear on it. It's pretty nice. So I don't know, that might be my new purse. And I picked up some wrapping paper. This is from the Christmas tree shop. I picked it up because I like the print. It's books and globes. And um, there's like tea and a bust and a clock. I like that. So I picked that up. And I picked this up to tea to dye paper with. It's just a, uh, it's like a table runner. Dye some paper with that. I like that print, very pretty. So I'll be using that, maybe. And then I pick this up to add to some Christmas tassels I will be making. It's beaded garland. And I picked up these red, these red doilies. Picked up mm, four sets of those. Probably be selling those. I picked up some strawberry fabric. Sorry about the shadow. That's from my my uh, tripod, which is real cute. I like that. And let's see. I picked up a couple more pieces of fabric. This is a very light pink with blue flowers. I love that. Super pretty. And then this is like a mm, kind of like a cross between a cornflower and a, a royal. And then it's got like forget me not little 
And I picked up some bag of doodads here. Picked this up for my daughter. It's French vanilla flavored lip balm from Dunkin' Donuts. I thought she would like that. Tess, my daughter Tess. And I picked up some cards. We'll be having these at the next sale. There's a beautiful, that's a black grouse in flight. And then this is a pheasant. And they're metallic. I think that's all there is. Yeah, the black grouse and the pheasant. Very pretty. So those will be available at the next sale. bought these angel wings there are so just I think there might be two sets per pack mm. yep looks like two two looks like a pair of wings per pack so those are kind of cool this wasn't all in this bag I just put it in here picked up some looks like oh it's a belt or a sash. I like the fabric. And this pink machine. Machine crochet. Yep, some pink machine crochet lace. And some green crochet lace. Got that. Put all that back in the bag so I don't. Use it. And I got a pile of doilies and table runners. And I will be doing build the bundles. I'll just put them here for now. <laughs> so you can see, I'll be doing build the bundles at the next sale. There's those. All sorts of fun stuff in there. And I found. Beautiful. This puzzle is just gorgeous. One second. It's called Butterfly Migration. $17 puzzle. the bag the pieces and then there's your picture I'm going to be selling that at my next sale if anyone would like to buy that that's going to go and then I bought some of this this is Rose printed. Here, let me open one of these. I just want to see how fine it is. It's netting, I'm pretty sure. Very what is this? Is it all the butterflies? Oh my god. This is like this is this is foam. It's foamy. I thought this was a netting. But it's like foamy. Huh. Hmm. What can I do with that, guys? What do you think? Any suggestions? Hmm. Maybe die cuts? Some little piggy die cuts? Would that be cute? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that? is about it i want to show i just want to show you guys what i've been making lately and then i will sign off oops and these are going to be available at my next sale which is this coming sunday i've been making tassels this one is hot pink red and black comes with this gorgeous spider this one is 
red and cream, very shabby. And this one, this one I went really overboard. <laughs> this is a really like super chunko, everything in it, huge, <laughs> huge tassel. There's another pumpkin. So I made three tassels for this upcoming sale. And I'm also going to have, um, ah, there'll be some surprises. And we're going to have two new sellers at the upcoming sale. And, you know, I always have a surprise or two up my sleeve. So I hope you enjoyed this haul. I got some pretty cool stuff, I think. Some nice, fun things for me to play with. And... I hope you enjoyed it, and I would love to see you on Sunday at the sale. It starts an hour early this week. It starts at 12 noon Eastern instead of 1 o'clock because we have seven sellers this week. Well, eight, including me, um, instead of six. So I would love to see you there. I hope you enjoyed this haul. I hope to see you soon. Take care, stay safe, and I'll see you in chat. Bye.